Hi, I'm Jayla Nysoy for Cal TV News. And I'm Jameson Weiss. Recently, the Interfraternity Council of UC Berkeley passed a proposal on granting every fraternity with a community development chair and creating a mandatory community development committee for each fraternity. We spoke to Greek community leaders about the mandate. We're here with Nanita Balagapol, the Vice President of Community Development of UC Berkeley's Panhellenic Council. Hi, Nanita. So could you please introduce us to your position? So Vice President of Community Development, it's basically my job to address race, sex, sexual orientation, and mental health discrimination in our community. Community development is extremely important in our community because there are definitely issues of discrimination and it's one of the most pressing issues I would say our community, the Greek community, faces. Currently, the Panhellenic community has four educational requirements. Um, one of those is community development. In the, in the in a fraternity council community, the IFC community, there are only two educational requirements and none of those were community development. So I found it a bit challenging addressing community development issues that I mentioned before uh, with women and addressing the power dynamic between men and women in this community when the men weren't educated. It's true. Our community is still um, like majority white. It still um, has racist undertones that just prevail um, simply as the institution has historically um, incubated it and cultivated that culture. The first part of that proposal is to have education required, so a presentation semesterly, in every fraternity chapter house. And the second part of the proposal would be to have a community development chair or representative in every house to be a resource to brothers in the community. Here, you truly have passionate and bright minds that are willing to tackle issues that maybe other Greek systems throughout even the state like aren't looking at currently. I think that is what makes our Calgary system special and I think that that's ultimately what's gonna make us better and better and progress to sustain.